Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Abyss World. <laughs> um, when it loads, as it will eventually. These things. Oh, there we go. I like the Abyss Room series. It's very relaxing, as it likes to boast on the App Store. But on top of that, um, I think I played the original for like two minutes. Wasn't really my um, my slice of cake, if you will. But then they came out with Pole. Well, really, I found Pole because um, I didn't really play it on release. But the point is, then they had Pole, and Pole was infinitely better than the original, in my opinion. And then, well, I kind of just like beat Pole because you can only do so much, and then it's it just gets repetitive and boring because. Um, my relationship with games is that I play, I'm very picky when it comes to games, I don't like every single game, and then I'll play a game, and then I'll lose interest after like a few months or so. Ooh, that looks cool. So anyways, this game just came out, and it looks very interesting, so why not? Why did you tell me that I have something to collect today if I don't? Poo poo on you. I do have something to collect though. My daily tasks. Okay. Um. Right. This game is adorable. Favorite thing, probably one of my favorite things in the whole game is this little. One of my least favorite things in the whole game is navigating it, but I love this little guy. Look at him, look at this spot. Oh, what a baby. Oh, love that. Being a baby is great. Everything in this game is just so adorable. It should be illegal how adorable it is. It should also be illegal how easy it is to be poor, but that's alright. This is a very nothing game. Busy work. And yeah, that's that can be a minus in some cases. But personally, I um I like I like busy work games, you know? Like taking something old, like um the Abyssrium series, and making it new by adding a bunch of things that don't need to be there and making it overly complicated for no reason. Some people see that as a negative. They'd be right to see it as a negative, because it kind of is, but um, I feel like it, it works in some cases, like the Ludia game, Dragon's Titan Uprising, where it takes the Match 3 formula, and the Park Builder formula, and Card Game formula, and kind of mishes them together, and a lot of things are needlessly complicated, but um, I think it works with the game, and also you can pet the dragons, which is adorable, but I got bored of that game. Like, I, lo I love you, Ludia. I love your games, Jurassic World Live and Titan Uprising, but I, I, I just get bored of them eventually. Sometimes they have, up well, I don't think there will be any update that could bring you back to Titan Uprising, but um, there is a Jurassic World Live update. So, sometimes, well, if it's worth it, I'll come back to it. But if it's not, then I don't. And some, you know, you get into like those. Um, Hyper fixations, where you, it's all you can really think about. And um, speaking of Jurassic World, the Camp Cretaceous just came out, which is a very good TV show. I enjoyed it very much, and it kind of got me in the Jurassic World spunk. So next year, it, um, next year's the movie, obviously the new one, Dominion, which looks. I don't know, because there's not really anything to go based off of, but I guess there are a few set images. But it looks um, good, I don't know. I shouldn't really have high hopes for it, because every single Jurassic World movie is less than okay. Except, oh, well, I like Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. A lot of people don't, but... I mean, I can see why. There's rushed pacing, and, you know, the characters or whatever. But, um, I don't know. I like the cinematography, and I like the beginning part, and I like the mansion part. 
It's just on the island is trash, really. I think we're all just tired of seeing the, um, the Jurassic Park formula where it's people go to island, everything goes wrong, dinosaurs go nuts, and they gotta get out of there. It, it's like literally every single movie. But at least Dominion decided that, hey, what if we got these dinosaurs on the mainland? Which is a very interesting thing. And also they're, you know, capitalizing on the whole... Everyone has dinosaurs now. Well, not everyone, just people who are people. But, um... I got extremely off topic. What I was trying to say was, Ludia, they seem to schedule their new games based on properties with the release of a movie on said property. For, uh, like, with the Dragons movies, they had Rise of Burke for the second one, and then Titan Uprising for the third, or maybe it was School of Dragons for the second one, I don't know. And then for Jurassic World, they had Jurassic World the game for Jurassic World, and then Jurassic World Alive for Fallen Kingdom. So I can only hope that with the release, before the release of Dominion, they'll announce and release a new Jurassic World game. Which, um, should be mildly interesting, really. Because they have a park builder game, and they have an AR game, so I don't really know where they, where else they could go with that, except for a match 3 game. Oh boy. A Jurassic World match 3 game. That would be... interesting, to say the least. If it was like Titan Uprising, I'd be sold, though. If I could pet Rexy and Blue, that would be adorable. Uh, yeah. S yeah, see, <laughs> the only way to get, um, any real footage out of this game is to just talk for a long time, because there's not a lot you can do. You can, I guess you can do this. Oh, I have fishy. So I'll settle fishy, and I'll get petals. In case anyone watching this, well, <laughs> I'm assuming people are already actually gonna watch it. Um, in case anyone watches this and play, who plays the game, and they're like, "How do I get petals?" and they don't know that there is an Abyssrium wiki that you can just go on and find out. Because apparently, um, the wiki is very lonely. They're like, they want people to use their wiki more. So use it. Whoever plays this game, go, go onto their wiki now and use their wiki. It takes work, <laughs> a lot of work, to make a Wikipedia page. Which is also why you should port, uh, support um, the actual Wikipedia, you know, like the OG. Give them, like, the price of a small copy or whatever they say, I don't know. Support everything, good causes, yes. Love, and peace, and whatever. Oh, 43 seconds. Okay, we'll stall for another 40 seconds and then we'll see the, the new fish that's coming. Or I could just pause the video for 43 seconds. But that'd be dumb because then you wouldn't get to hear my beautiful, beautiful voice for 43 seconds. <laughs> I really like the rays in this game. The um, stingrays. I think they're uh, like my favorite things in this game. I know I said the Atlantic football fish before, but like. Just the look of rays are cool. I mean, the baby pink ray is... It's a bit big for a baby. <laughs> but on top of that, it's, like, uh, pretty cartoony. So, it's, like, less of a favorite. But, um, this one, the spotted... E is this the... Uh, is this the, um, dude from... Dude Bro from Finding Nemo? Oh. Purification for... That is complete. So, I'll take my reward. And then we'll announce this new tropical, ugly. It's not that ugly, actually. I thought it looked like Bruxish, but you know, when you look at it closer, it just looks like a cupcake. A little fishy cupcake. Probably wouldn't taste like one, though. It would taste like fish, which doesn't taste anything like cupcakes. That's not to say fish don't taste good. I mean, I like salmon, I guess. But, yeah, I don't know, everything tastes weird and different. Nothing tastes the same. Unless it's like the same thing, then it tastes the same. Like, licorice and licorice taste the same. Unless one day you have cold, then it doesn't taste the same as the day you didn't. Or you just don't like licorice anymore, because that could happen too. But the point is, 
things. Take, wait, no. I don't want that. I want that. I want a dolphin. I don't have enough for a dolphin. I need these. In order to get those, I need to have a tier 4. So in order... So in order to get those, I need this. But in order to get this, I need more vitality. So, give me some vitality, a little garbage eating piece of coral thing. I'll, I'll watch one of these. Later.